Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I uh, just put a, a little video together uh, for the SR40. I had it at the range the other day when I was doing the 22 long rifle video and just uh, did a little target practice. And I'm going to go ahead and put in the, uh, the video here with the uh, target that I was shooting at. And then I'll roll in some video of the actual shooting while I was at the range. So uh, enjoy and thanks for watching. Alright guys, this is the uh, target I was using at the range the other day. Uh, I was shooting 40 caliber at it. Uh, just trying to kill off some of my reloads there that I wasn't real, real satisfied with. Uh, I just used a plated bullet and I wasn't real happy with the uh, suggested uh, powder load on it. Which was fine. Most of the time it worked perfect or close to perfect enough. Um, the What it was doing was the gun was not cycling. Uh, sometimes it would eject the casing and the slide wouldn't uh, kick back far enough to either grab another round or sometimes it would kick back just almost enough and then slide the empty right back up in the cylinder. Uh, I know it's easily resolved you know a little bit uh, powder you know, just a touch more but uh, I wanted to uh, go ahead and just uh, do a little target practice go ahead you know uh, kill them off and uh, reload with a little bit uh, heavier bullet that uh, goes with the 40 caliber these these are actually 165 grain bullets and I wanted to go ahead and load the 180s and uh, so overall, uh, with 165 grain reloads, this was uh, probably around 20 to 25 feet. Uh, you can judge that in the video. Uh, this was the first area right here that I was uh, shooting at. Uh, I was aiming for the eight, number eight over here. So I was shooting just a little bit high, but nothing, you know, nothing real bad. Uh, and I think I only had one problem, uh, one little kind of cycling jam uh, with that. Uh, then I decided to go ahead and run some of my uh, uh, Hornaday XTP reloads. And I was uh, really aiming for the uh, X right here. Uh, it it kind of reared up on me a little bit as I shot uh, about eight rounds for that I mean yeah that's still if I if I shot it actually somebody to for in an act, you know, incident that I was uh, having someone was going to attack me or something you know that's still going to stop them pretty good um, up here I was just kind of running 30 rounds through the gun just uh, emptying it out uh, for the head shot these once again are the the 165 grain uh, reloads that I did uh, which actually held a uh, pretty good pattern there for that. Uh, so, but I just wanted to, to do a little video, you know, actually shooting the gun, and because uh, I had it with me while I was doing my other 22 uh, long rifle uh, video, so I just went ahead and was uh, doing a little shooting with the 40 caliber. So I'll go ahead and uh, run that video and uh, enjoy. And thanks for watching.